Welcome to a new tutorial. This tutorial is complete code operation in ASP.NET Core with SQL step by step. Start Visual Studio 2017. This is version 2017. Now I'm gonna create a new project. File new project. Select .NET Core in the left hand. Select ASP.NET Core web application. Select the directory where the application will be stored. Yes, a step. Name the application. Application name is root underscore ASP underscore code okay click on ok yes this is the empty API select web application and then click ok the application is created yes for the solution explorer and right click add a new folder new folder folder name is model okay now I'm gonna add a class in the model okay class name is student class student click on add okay the class is added public integer student ID get set I just copy first to reducing time student name string this is a string type and third one is address fourth one is case and phone number is also a string and email also a string type finally date of birth date of birth is date time so it's done now go to the face folder right click add new folder folder name is students in this students face folder i will create face so right click click on add new scaffolded item click on scaffolded item select razor face select razor face using entity framework code i can see generates razor face using entity framework create delete details edit and list operation for the given model click on add select the model class my model class is a student class so just select student class okay and select the data context this is the crude sp core context click on add this is added finally click on add yes it's generating the page and code okay it's generated index.html you can see edit clear details let's check in the solution explorer expand the students folder yes you can see clear delete details edit and index page also created with controller okay now I'm gonna add migration using package manager console this is the package manager console if you don't have the package manager console uh, you can get it from the tools click on tools menu and click on any get package manager console select package manager console now write command command is add migration initial click on enter yes it's migrating let's check the migration in the solution explorer yes migration is added now get the database just for the view and go to the SQL server object explorer now there is no database in the local server okay now just click on update database update hyphen database click on enter yes yes it's done database is created let's check right click the database and refresh okay the crude as code context database is created successfully and the table name is students student okay now select the application crude as code 
and debug okay it's debugging done now for the slash and student application is students page is page folders name is students okay get new now i'm gonna inserting a record name jack address usa page 22 phone phone number email email address and dob date of birth for the date of birth create or oh, it's displaying an error the dear dob, uh, dob field is required it requires time also later on i will show how to put date only instead of uh, date time okay the record is inserted successfully now i'm gonna create one more record this is name sandy address canada is 18 phone number email and date of birth okay click on create yes there are two record in the list now click on edit you can edit any any records and phone number i just change the phone number or oh, for the date of birth field click on save yes it's saved the phone number is changed okay now let's check the details yes these are the details of the student delete yes it's deleted successfully now i'm gonna create uh, one more record name orani address india age 25 phone number email and date of birth okay create yes it's created successfully now stop debugging and let's check the records in the database table view data yes the two uh, records inserted successfully in the student table now see the designer student id address date of birth email name phone and age now i'm gonna change date format date time to date only okay i'll change date format in create and edit page so input in the input put format date format mm month day year mmdd and yy type equal to date okay and in the create phase same type equal to date and format just copy the format option and paste it in the create in input okay run yes create now see that displaying the day, date instead of date time edit yes it's also same let's check okay save click on save yes successfully save 